There is no gemstone in the world quite like a diamond. Formed by nature, the average diamond is 3.3 billion years old. A diamond is a testament of endurance and strength, and not surprisingly, the ultimate symbol of love. If you're shopping for a diamond, chances are you're celebrating an exciting and emotionally charged moment in your life. As you sit down with your favorite trusted jeweler, you probably have a lot of questions and concerns, like, how can I be sure that what I'm purchasing is a real natural diamond? How do I know if the diamond has been treated? You may also wonder about the methods used to assign value to these unique and beautiful stones. You know you want to buy a piece that speaks to your heart, but you also want to make a smart purchase. So where do you begin? The key to understanding diamonds is to understand the four attributes that all diamonds have in common. These four attributes, color, clarity, cut, and carat weight, are known as the four C's. The Gemological Institute of America, or GIA, developed the four C's to create a universal language when it came to the difficult task of determining diamond quality. Established in 1931, Nonprofit GIA is the largest and most respected institute of gemological research and learning in the world. GIA confers the jewelry industry's highest professional diploma, the Graduate Gemologist Diploma. And GIA maintains the world's most advanced research laboratory for the scientific study of gemstones. GIA created not only the four C's, but also the International Diamond Grading System, the grading standard used worldwide. And today, GIA is the keeper of this standard to protect all consumers of gemstones. Diamonds of all shapes and sizes come to GIA from every corner of the globe for analysis and grading, including the world's most famous diamonds, like the Smithsonian's Blue Hope Diamond and the De Beers' Millennium Star. Let's select a diamond and see how it rates for color, clarity, cut, and carat weight by taking it through some of the steps in the GIA grading process. At the GIA laboratory, scientific precision rules. Expert gemologists examine each diamond under tightly controlled lighting and viewing conditions. The goal is to provide the most rigorous assessment of a diamond's four C's. To be sure that our diamond is graded in the most consistent and objective manner possible, our diamond will travel through the laboratory housed in a nondescript plastic cassette like all other diamonds. Before even stepping into the four C's, our diamond is subjected to the first of many tests it will undergo in the grading process. Here, it is tested to determine whether our diamond is natural or lab-grown. If our diamond were synthetic, it would be pulled out of the queue and subjected to a separate procedure. But our diamond is a natural diamond, so now it's on to the four C's. The first C is color. When it comes to diamonds, the less color, the higher the grade. The GIA color scale classifies diamonds from D, colorless, to Z, light yellow or brown. Each letter grade represents a range of color and is a measure of how noticeable a color is. Truly colorless diamonds are very rare. Most diamonds used in jewelry are nearly colorless with tints of yellow or brown. To provide a universal basis for color comparison, GIA gemologists meticulously assembled a set of master stones representing the color grades on the GIA scale. At the GIA lab, a color grade is determined by comparing each diamond to a master set that has been assembled by carefully matching diamonds to the original set. Let's take a look at our diamond and see where it falls on the color grading scale. Our diamond received a color grade of G. The second C is clarity. Because diamonds form under tremendous heat and pressure, it is extremely rare to find a diamond with no internal or surface reaching inclusions. Inclusions are a byproduct of its formation and actually help gemologists separate natural diamonds from synthetics and lookalikes. The GIA clarity scale includes 11 clarity grades ranging from flawless to I3. Flawless indicates that there are no inclusions or blemishes visible at 10x magnification. A grade of I3 is for diamonds with inclusions that are obvious to the naked eye. Diamond graders at GIA laboratories use a 10x magnification loop and a microscope to see and plot the inclusions. Since no two diamonds are exactly alike, this unique plot helps identify a particular stone. During this step, 
Graders also look to see if there is any evidence that our diamond was treated to improve its clarity, and any treatment will be noted on our diamond's report. Let's see how our diamond looks under 10x magnification. Our diamond has six small inclusions that are not visible to the naked eye, but can be seen at higher magnification. Here, you can see the inclusions noted in red on our diamond's clarity plot. Our diamond received a clarity grade of VS2, or very slightly included too. The third C is cut. The GIA cut scale is used for round, brilliant cut diamonds and consists of five grades, ranging from excellent to poor. You may think of cut as the shape of a diamond, like square cut or round. However, there is much more to cut than the basic shape. How a diamond is cut and polished directly affects the amount of sparkle and brilliance that comes off the stone when it interacts with light. How light strikes the surface, how much enters the diamond, and how and in what form light returns to your eye. A polished diamond's proportions affect its light performance, which in turn affects its beauty and overall appeal. Our diamond is placed in a highly precise measuring device that rotates the stone 360 degrees to optically capture hundreds of measurements and facet angles, enough to generate a 3D model of the actual diamond. Since there is no single set of proportions that define a well-cut diamond, a cut grade needs to be determined by factoring in a range of parameters. After 15 years of research, GIA scientists developed a comprehensive system that factors the diamond's proportions, as well as its culet size, girdle thickness, polish, and symmetry descriptions, and generates a GIA cut grade. Our diamond received a cut grade of excellent. The fourth C is carat weight. One carat equals 200 milligrams, or one-fifth of a gram in weight. Larger diamonds are more rare than smaller diamonds, so all other factors being equal, a single one-carat stone would be worth more than four quarter-carat stones put together. However, the value of a diamond is determined by considering all four Cs, so bigger is not always better. At the GIA lab, our diamond is placed in a sealed chamber and weighed on an extremely precise electronic scale to the fifth decimal place. The weight is then rounded to the second decimal place. Our diamond weighs 2.07 carats. Our diamond's four C's, along with a wealth of additional information, appears on its GIA grading report. A GIA report is the most technologically advanced diamond evaluation possible. It provides a unique blueprint of a diamond's attributes and a permanent record of its quality. And GIA's online report check provides an additional level of assurance. It allows you to quickly and conveniently confirm that the information you received matches the original grading archived in GIA's database. As an added security feature, diamonds graded at GIA can be microscopically inscribed along the girdle with their unique GIA report number, a personal message, or even a logo. Laser inscription allows you to easily identify your diamond and provides an indisputable link to your diamond's grading report. Whether you're celebrating the past or getting ready to leap into the future, there is no better way to commemorate this important moment in time than with a diamond, a symbol of timelessness itself. The act of choosing your diamond should be exciting and enjoyable. Just keep all the four C's in mind. Color, clarity, cut, and carat weight. And be sure to always ask your jeweler for a GIA report, your ultimate assurance of your diamond's quality. What you've chosen is rare, unique, and breathtakingly beautiful. You've chosen a diamond, and you've chosen well. For more information about diamonds, the four C's, or GIA, go to www.gia4cs.gia.edu because a GIA grading report is the difference between wondering and knowing.